Once again, welcome back to Captain Sandy's channel. This is your Sandy reporting. So today I'll be showing you some of the things and its costs that are inside the food basic store actually. So when you uh, see these kinds of uh, cost, I think you can sort it out and make your grocery list economical. So let's get inside. So this is how the groceries is inside and you can see it's $3.88. The one thing that I was fascinated was the variety of breads that we're displaying actually, not displaying, they kept. So there are so many breads in here. As you can see right. So the cost the cost is in constant, sometimes it varies. So the actual cost here you can see was like two or two dollars and twenty nine cents, but now it's like one dollar and ninety nine cents. So the cost might vary. But we need to get aware of when they will uh, change the or reduce the cost so everything you see here is the cookies bread let's go to the uh, vegetable section so i think you have now an idea of how the inside store looks like not only food basics but even costco and fresco also so uh, in upcoming days i'll be sharing you some of the things that are there as well so now I think you are getting an idea so here there are so many vegetables but each and every uh, vegetable cost like very some might be six dollars see can you see the difference it's the yellow onions is six dollars and eighty-eight cents, and here the red onions are like nine dollars and eighty-eight cents. So I think you might now get idea. See, and the red onions are like four dollars and ninety-eight cents. Okay, so let's pick one yellow onion. So here you see it's like plant based so everything they have on the top and now to our favorite section so where we can see a uh, huge amount of meat chunks of meat actually from beef pork chicken fish you can see over here right here so it uh, changes so once again I say like frequently visiting this place might give us some idea of when the cost will get reduced and when it will not so it's a huge store actually luckily I'm my house is near the store so whenever I need some groceries just uh, five minutes to ten minutes walk from there to here and then I just need to uh, buy some things that's it so you can see right so you can see the numbers above so each rack has a separate uh, items that are being sold and these are all the dairy products so you can see here the milk and these are all the sanitary ones so this is how big uh, the food basics is but when you go to Walmart I think Walmart is like twice the size of this food basic actually so you can see our uh, ready-made uh, food packets so all you need is just heat it and consume it that's it So this is how the food basics is stored inside. So I hope you will get an idea of cost of each thing. So I think this week, okay, let's try this one then. Flatbread pizza. It's for two dollars and ninety-eight cents. But trust me, at the beginning of arrival to Canada, you will feel 
uh, like eating all the foods that you see but at one point of time you'll get bored of eating it so you'll be craving for some other uh, vegan food to be honest so far um, I brought onions one bag of onions and then some chips and then one pizza because uh, I haven't had pizza for a day so like sounds like more like when I think about it like my mouth is watering so I bought one pizza thin crust pizza and then yeah that's it I think so so if you maintain a proper list I think you can manage all the things so maintaining a list helps you in uh, removing the unnecessary expenditure for things that you want to buy and yeah so that's what it is so if you want to go economical in Canada then this is what you should do so this is a small food basic store that I would like to uh, share it with you so until then this is Captain Sandy signing off see you on the next episode bye so hey don't close the video there's still one thing to complete actually so why is this video is because most of my fellow viewers would have the eagerness to know what a shop a supermarket would look like inside but the real happiness and excitement comes when you go inside and explore all the groceries that you want to know so i hope this video would have quenched your eagerness so next time i will see you at a very good place at a wonderful place that you have ever seen so far so until then this is sandy signing off bye bye